follow me Or would you let it be If I leave tonight We could do this right We'll find the remedy Or would you stay with me now Till the morning light Hello Hello How are you guys? Sorry, we're a little bit late. As always, I had to restart my computer. And you I guys know how it is. My hair. It wasn't <laughs> just Aaron this time. It was me. Don't worry. Uh, I will give a preface. I have not had my medication for like three days. As we could all tell from my video today, I'm feeling a little intense and tired. So I'm going to try to tone it down a little bit. I'm really more just exhausted and not feeling well at this point. Um, but... I am feeling up to reacting and not, I'm not so intense right anymore. It's more of like, I'm not feeling well. Yeah. So. And then tired, you said. Oh yeah. And I'm so, 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 so tired. Yeah. Like I get so fatigued. I actually looked at Riley tonight and I was like, am I getting sick? Like, I don't feel well. Like, and I was like, when I was talking to you just a second ago and I was like, oh, it's because I'm taking my medicine in three days. Yeah. Like I've been out and now it kind of makes sense. So I just wanted to give you all a heads up. I love that we can talk about those things here. I think that that's important. Yeah. You know? Yeah. I mean, it, like, I don't want it to be, like, yeah, I don't want it to be taboo. Um, yeah. If y'all have, if y'all have gotten off SSRIs, like, you know, like that, it's not good for you. Um, it gives you brain zaps. It makes you feel like you have the flu. So I'm starting to just not feel good today, but I'll get them tomorrow. Um, and that's part of why my Kim Marshall is <laughs> so intense because it was like, the the because I, I did it yesterday like I filmed it last night it was like the second day of not having it and so I was like super like I don't know my emotions were whacked and so it's a good video but yeah I get a little intense <laughs> so. I mean it's all good I again I'm just glad that we can have these conversations you know and that by having <gasps> these conversations Happy Veterans Day. oh uh, thanks guys thanks Blaze Goddess that's super kind of you um I was pissed on TikTok earlier. I don't know if you guys saw it. <laughs> but there's a Saint Hun that's telling like a story about her husband who's a veteran and his um, brother who passed away during military service. And she's doing her Saint makeup. Mm -hmm. Selling Saint makeup while talking about these veterans. And it like... I text JJ and I was like, I am so mad right now. I'm shaking. <laughs> yeah. But I'm laughing because I'm like, I don't know how else to get that kind of emotion out of me because you're preying on the military community. You're praying or trying to prey on veterans. You're trying to prey on people with PTSD because that was mentioned in her video and I wasn't having it. So if you're on TikTok, you know, go drop a comment, go share it out or whatever. I would appreciate yes. it. Please do. Because um, it's disgusting. It was awful. I watched it. I was like. I was so mad. I'm, and I was trying to be calm. But like oh, I was. Yeah, you did a good job being calm. But like. Thank you. It, you it could tell I was pissed. Valid. Yeah. You're valid. And feeling that way. Yeah. Most of the time I always get. I also get very angry. Like Hulk level. Yeah. So like when you're. When you get off. First off. Maggie said. If you don't mind. Why'd you get off? I just ran out. I just ran out. And forgot to order more. So I'm picking it up tomorrow. So I was not on purpose. It just happened. And uh, yeah. Like. Aaron knows I like she's seen me when I'm whacked out you get so angry you don't know how to like yeah it, it's hard to um what is it um center yourself I guess or like ground like, uh, like grounding yourself yeah grounding yeah, your emotions. Hard to, like come back and like calm yeah. yourself down it's very difficult to do uh so I think that's one of the things um I've learned from our friendship is being able to have these conversations and being able to say and it to be received well like hey have you been have you been taking your medication and then like just through conversations you're like oh wait i haven't you know what i mean like it helps yeah put pieces together i guess yeah not absolutely. me just i don't know how to word that i feel like i'm wording that really weird oh yeah no it's great it's just you being a good friend and like yeah i care happen. yeah exactly yeah get the behind me saint hun <laughs> oh god i was so pissed and <laughs> oh. um somebody sent it to me kim sent it to me and she was like, I immediately thought of you. And I was like, oh, well, I'm going to do it. I literally just got back from the gym. By the way, you guys, I don't know if you saw my stories. I just, I need to tell y'all, I, I bench pressed 135 pounds today. Yes, I just need did. to tell somebody. That bitch. Look at her. And so I was a little, I was a little hyped up from the gym, but I like, I, 
don't mess with my fellow veterans. Like, leave us alone. Mm -mm. Happy Veterans Day. Yeah. Thanks, guys. Thank you so much. Thank and, and shout out to all the veterans that are watching and um, appreciate you guys. Thank you all for your service and your family members if they served. Thank you to them. Yeah. Um, I appreciate I respect y'all so much. I'm getting so strong. It's so exciting. Yeah. Can I, can I tell you a story real quick about it? Of course you can. Okay. You probably know, JJ. Hopefully. <laughs> you I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> you do. Um, okay. So my husband and I went to the gym today. And you know how you see those videos on TikTok? Like the gym. I don't know if the algorithm is, is in your favor, like showing you gym videos. But for me, yeah. I see like strong women type videos. And there are some where these women are, are just pushing or pulling really, really intense heavy weights. I was in the Air Force. And uh, then you see these guys that are looking around and they're, they're looking like, nah, she's not going to pull that or she's not going to push that. And then they do. And then you get their reaction and they're like, that happened today. <laughs> so I'm a little tired today as well. Um, but I think it's I think it's just where I'm at in my month kind of thing. We'll yeah. just leave it at that. My, and Riley heard me a second ago and I haven't told him about my medicine. And he texted me, you haven't taken your medicine in three days. You got in trouble. <laughs> I did. <laughs> so sad, I'm sure. So <laughs> he's me about it all the time. I feel so bad. Because, you know, no, he has I... to get the brunt of it, you know. And so it's like, I feel bad. You guys are a team when it comes to this, though. Oh, yeah. He's like. You guys are a team. on, works with my therapist. Like, yeah, it's all thing. He's, he's yeah, amazing. I love that. Riley, Riley, you're the best if you hear it. Okay. Truly, really, really is. So we're at the gym and I just did like 95 pounds. And my husband was spotting me. I didn't I didn't need him to spot me, but he knew I was feeling kind of tired, so he was right there. Mm -hmm. So I I put up the 95 pounds like six times. And then um I re-racked the weight and he goes. <laughs> You can do 135. And I look, I wish y'all would have, you know how I am with facial expressions. I wish y'all would have seen my facial <laughs> expression. Oh my God. Cause I looked at him and I was like 135. And then like a couple benches down, there was this guy that I see all the time in the gym. And I looked at him and I was like, he thinks I can do 135. And he was like, and you can. And I was like, wait a second, whose side are you on? <laughs> and so, so Jerry, my husband, he puts the weight on and I'm looking at him like, you've got to be kidding me. You've got to be kidding me. And I was like, all right, I guess we're doing this thing. There was a guy standing behind him that was looking at him like, <sighs> and I wish he would have told me before because I would have thrown that 135 up so fast. I would have done multiple reps. <laughs> like I would have thrown it up like three times or something just out of spite. Yeah, 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 yeah. I've seen and I didn't know any of this until after. And so anyways, I throw it up. I just did one rep because it was on my third set. So I was already kind of fatigued. So mm -hmm. I threw it up and I was like, what in the world? My husband is like clapping and cheering in the gym for me. He's like, yeah. He texted me that and I was like, strong. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And so I guess when he turned around, the guy was like, yeah, it was great. So anyways, that's my story. I had I a great day. It. And a I bought day. jeans today. <gasps> We love a good pair of jeans. Um, Stella said, I was recently called crazy because I go to therapy. I think people what? who do that, I think people who do that are the people who also need to go to therapy. Like I if they're calling projection. you crazy. Yeah, absolutely. That's what it is. Like if they're calling you crazy because you go to therapy because you're trying to get your life together, then they better have all their shit together. They right. better be straight, a straight edge, like no slip. And they aren't yeah. because normal people... People who are decent people don't call people crazy for taking care of themselves. Mm -hmm. Anyway, let's hear it. I have a little drinky drink. Should we do some bubbles? I don't think these give very like good bubbles, but they're bubbles. This is that holiday. Uh, I, by the way, this is really the only time I ever have like a beverage is when I'm live with you guys. <laughs> yeah, glass houses and stones. Absolutely, Maggie. Yeah. And this is Barry Bramble style. They make your butt look, Erin. I know. I'm going to ask you. Listen. You told me. You told me. Janet, sure. it makes my butt look like this. First of all, let's talk yeah. about this. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm a curvy, muscular girl. I'm not, I'm not a tiny girl. Not that there's anything wrong with tiny girls or any size and shape. I just know after 42 years, the shape of my body. Yeah. And some of these pockets on these jeans for us curvy women 
are ridiculous. But these, they make my butt look like this. I'll put some, I'm going to, I'm going to do a little fashion show for my husband. Cause we do that when we buy new clothes in this household. So I'll put, I'll put it in my Instagram story, but we have a double date tomorrow and I just felt like I needed something new, you know? I love that for you. <laughs> yes. Let's talk about Aaron's butt, Maggie. Oh, excuse oh. me. I haven't told you this, JJ. Guess who I saw today driving on the way back from the mall? Air Corey. Michael Rutherford. <gasps> Michael Rutherford is one of the top people in. He's higher uh, than Jesse. Prove it. Yes. Yes. Oh, well, welcome, Danny. Thank you so much. Yes. Yeah. I feel like I'm talking a mile a minute. Let's get to some bubbles. Bubbles. <laughs> Aaron's bringing the high energy. Julie's bringing the, the low energy. I don't know why I have it such it energy tonight. That one doesn't bubble as much. I know. It's kind of a letdown. I like down. the crisp crack, though. That's pretty nice. Yeah, I do appreciate that crack, the cracking. I also, love you have high energy. You're what? I love that you have high energy tonight. We I, always balance one another in some way, shape, or form. I love that about us. Yeah. Um, Danielle, what part of El Paso are you from? When I was in MLM, I used to do parties all over the east side and the west side. Yeah, so I'm just, if you feel comfortable, what part of El Paso are you in? And if not, that's okay too. <laughs> Higher than boss lead, that's, you said impossible, which made it even more funny. I think you meant impossible, yeah. but that's impossible. That, I it. think that makes it even more funny. Thank you guys for all the happy Veterans Day wishes. I appreciate yeah. you and to anybody um, that you know that's a veteran, please tell them, you know, thank you for their service. Far East. Oh, yeah. Like Socorro too. Far East? We're speaking, we're speaking my language, Danielle. Linda. Hey, Linda. Welcome, welcome. Stella said, I adore you too. That's so sweet. Thank you. you guys so much. So you probably saw the thumbnail. Did you see the thumbnail? It's a great thumbnail. Thank you for making that Thanks. for us. I just whooped that thing up. I really. love that. Thank you. So we're talking a little about Mariska tonight. And, you know, because Vic closed down. So where'd she go? What's she doing? Type mm -hmm. of thing, right? And uh, I think we might do more videos like this. I like the idea of like, I forgot what I, what did I title it? It was like. An update. Um, where are they now? Where are they now type of update, right? And so It's giving that show from, I think, is it VH1? I think I know what you mean. Like, where are these celebrities now, right? Like, that were, like, child celebrities usually or something like that. Or ones you haven't heard from in a while. Yeah. Oh, my God. Look at this comment. So, I cashed a check from a hun a little while ago. I cash a lot of check checks. I cash a lot, excuse me, from huns. And the amounts are wild. Well, this one wasn't even $40, even with the fee. I couldn't believe it. Eww. Yikes. Yikes. Maggie says to lick the stream. <laughs> lick the stream. Hit the lick button. You know that one? Oh, wait. Hit the lick button. I forgot to tell you something, JJ. Oh, what? Yes, I bought some jeans. But guess what else I bought? Hold on. Can I guess? Yeah. I don't know Can if I, I don't know if you're going to get this because I've never worn this before. Uh, a sweater vest. No, not a sweater vest. Mm -mm. You never worn it before? No. Um, a, a crop top. No, I, I have worn a crop top. You've worn one before. Yeah. Uh, a, a tube top. No. No. Uh, uh, um, <laughs> you guys can guess, obviously, in the comments, too. Blaze Goddess says a jumper. No, but I do love a good jumper. Oh, oh we God. love good jumpers. I love good jumpers. Hi. By the way, I did order a onesie the other day from Fabletics. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> I can never come. I can never get myself to commit to fabletics. Oh God, I'm I, I'm gonna model it. I'm probably gonna wear it on live. I'm not gonna lie. Bodysuit. Bodysuit. I bought two bodysuits, you guys. Good job, Shelby. That was yeah, a, right. Yes. Buy high boots. Bye, I love all boots. these. <laughs> Ch chaps. chaps. <laughs> you said impossible. Now you say chaps. You're on a roll. Oh my like, God, I love you guys so much. It's ridiculous. Crocs? Oh no, we live in the Crocs. I do love some Crocs. Mine are purple. Mm -hmm. um corset that's a good guess i do love a good corset every so often <laughs> yeah i'm a good guesser <laughs> so yeah that's what we're doing tonight we're going to take a look at that video 
and uh, see what's going on. I mean, I know. I Okay, so fun fact. Before she even announced it, which she said she was going to announce it later, she hadn't announced it yet. It was already in her linked tree. Yeah, I just figured it out. <laughs> I was mm-hmm. like, okay, click. Um, but yeah. I've heard that about Savage and Fenty. I was actually looking at their site the other day because I like some of their, I like their, some of their stuff. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I've heard about that too. Yeah. Onesies for everybody is how I feel. Onesies for everybody. Can we have a onesie themed live we where can. everybody wears a onesie like for the holidays or something? If you're able to do that. I think that'd be so cool. Oh my God. Danielle says, enjoying my wine slash drink in my onesie on the patio in the cool weather finally yes danielle that is the vibe that we're talking about i love that onesies for everybody okay are we ready to get this thing started 110 percent. like the video if you guys haven't on both of our channels pretty please and thank you and um yeah i'll let you, i'll let you press the button because you know what happens when i mess with it i rewind it to the beginning i'm just not gonna do that tonight Why is it so awkward always at the beginning? Hello? Anyone there? <laughs> Caller, are right you before. there? Yeah, I paused it right before she spoke. Whoops. Good evening. Good evening. Hi, Jerry. Hi, Amber. Hi, Jasmine. Hi, Joanne. We haven't watched this either. We're blind reacting, Everyone by the way. From all over the place. Love, love, love it. Okay. Let's get this started. Yes, please. It is seven o'clock. Yes, it is. It is seven. Okay. Hi, hi, hi. Good evening. As people start hopping in, I'll be approving them. Um, if somebody messages you and says, hey, sh- I'm not being let in, just try to unmute yourself or wave or something, and I will make sure to go and check it. But I didn't put um, a password on this as some people struggle with the password and can't get yes, in. Did. So I was like, well, we'll just do it this way. So Welcome to our very first opportunity Zoom uh, with Beauty Society. I am super excited. I'm Mary Scott, if you don't know me, um, and I see plethora. That, that's the MLM. Beauty Society is the MLM. Yeah. Look at this comment. I'm going to start a master class on how to teach the master class on, on how to use <laughs> <laughs> That's so funny. Yes, this they is. They also see this- it. <laughs> this is current. This is within the last, I don't know, I want to say the last week or so. Yeah. Okay, I'm ready now. Of our amazing team members who some of you guys I have walked with for many years. Um, Some of you guys, maybe a year, maybe just we've kind of been in the same companies, but we haven't done this together. Um, But I'm really, really excited about this company and what we have here and what sets us apart. And so I'm going to kind of go through, hey, DC, some of the things that really stood out to me um, when I decided to join Beauty Society. And as a person that has always been with something new, For me, I wanted something that wasn't new, something that was established, something that had their systems down, something that had their products down, something that I felt like I wouldn't personally have. I love that at the beginning of this, she mentioned basically cross recruiting where she was like, maybe we were in the same company together, but not like on the same team. Okay. So Uh cool. Uh Cross recruiting. Love that for you, Mary. Like, my thing is, like, if you're going to, if you're just going to say it, just freaking say it. Don't beat around the bush. Just yeah. go for gold. Like, just go, like, it's very much, uh, she's trying not to, like, act like she's cross-recruiting, but she is. They all do. It, it, you are. Like, there's just no ifs, ands, or buts about it. Yeah. Yeah. You are. I mean, how, you, she had, I think she had one of the biggest teams under Vic. I think she was one of the top, top people. Of course you're going to cross recruit because why all those people lost their company as well. Yep. What if, anyway. Mm. Be wondering if tomorrow would be um, here or not. Cause 
you guys don't know, I was from a company I've been with two now that have closed down, um, that were new. And so to me, we it was love that. super important to find a company that was, <laughs> if that doesn't tell you something, two of, her companies down. <laughs> two of her companies have closed down. I oh. swear. Bye, Melissa. Oh, have Table. fun, Melissa. And so I'm going to kind of walk through some slides with you guys and my journey. And if you are a, a current beauty um, advisor, I'd love for you to put in the comments. Does anybody think that she was struggling with what they call their distributors? Cause she was used to what Vic beauty calls their <laughs> distributors. If you have been a, uh, <laughs> action, what's something that stood out to you about this company this um, and why you decided to choose it? So I'm going to, as I'm opening this up, um, obviously I have my welcome here. We're going to go right into this though. Let me just, it's a let me, okay, so let me first talk about our CEO, Jeannie. She is incredible. I got to meet her in person this last week and I will say she is a guys. I don't know if there was a company event, but typically Based off of my experience, and I'm not saying that Mary Scott did this, but in my experience, if somebody has met the CEO that is starting in a new company, it's because they were flown in. And when you're flown in, in my opinion, that is setting the stage for a bridge contract. That's, that's what that is. So mm -hmm. uh, I'm curious to find out the details on that. Also, I don't know who created this. Hey, Mary, nobody can read that. Not no, no and nobody's way. gonna read it. That's that looks like trash. I'm sorry. I'm just gonna say what I'm <laughs> yeah. Breath of fresh air, whether you've met her in person or not, and you can kind of quietly read through this. I'm not gonna go and read through everything about her, but but I'm gonna tell you my experience. Um you know, meeting her even on a Zoom call, I felt connection. I felt like this sense of peace of um, this girl is real. She is legit um, just a person that uh, didn't have much beauty experience. She's like the everyday woman, somebody that, you know, wanted, tried all these beauty products. Nothing would. This is a great question. What is a bridge contract? A bridge contract is a contract that a distributor can put in place with the company that they're going to, and they are locked into a certain amount of income, but there's stipulations within that contract that they have to meet at within a certain time period. So it could be a year, it could be two years. They can pretty much customize all of that. They negotiate those contracts. That's what a bridge contract is. And the thing that is unethical about that, in my opinion, is the fact that when you come in with a bridge contract, you are your income is established. But what we see from a lot of these top leaders that come into these other companies with a bridge contract is that they cross recruit and expect people from their old team to come with them. And their old team that does come with them has to start over. They're not locked into the income, but the leader is. And then typically that leader does not disclose to those people that they have a bridge contract. So they'll present things in a way where it's like, oh no, this is great. You know, and we're going to make so much more money. Yeah. The leader is locked into a specific income, but then they expect their people from their previous teams and companies to rebuild it's disgusting and it's greedy mm -hmm. and deceptive. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that's a bridge contract work. And she just wanted something more. And so what did she do? She decided to start a business and a very successful business at all at that and partnered with, um, Bill Rizzo, who is actually created Estee Lauder. And so he started formulating some of our products. Well, the scientists that are our, our scientists have worked under him for years. So it's really cool to, to meet them as well. I got to meet them this last week and, and just to see 
the formulas that they put together and why they put it together. Um, if you don't know, these products and these ingredients are clinical. They're incredible ingredients. Um, but she also wanted to build not just something that shows beauty on the outside, but beauty on the inside. So um, it's beauty society because she's saying, let's build a community of beauty. I love that. I connected with it. Um, but not only just that, she's also gotten into it. I'll go further into this is, you know, let's not just care for people, but what about our, our, you know, environment? Excuse me, but Estee Lauder found it Estee Lauder. <laughs> that part. And I just loved the ph philanthropy aspect of this company. So let's move on a little bit. That's a little bit about our CEO. Nobody She's read that, Mary. Amazing. But let's talk about our product. So our skincare comes with a 12 month money. Listen to this wording. Working with smart science. <laughs> what smart is, science? What is smart science? Like that just sounds like. Like to, did this particular science get a higher grade on something? Like <laughs> the SATs or something? It I sounds understand. like a high schooler or a middle schooler putting together a PowerPoint presentation for their computer class. I don't get it. <laughs> I also, just... can someone tell me the difference between clinical skincare and skincare? Can someone like tell me the difference? Like, I don't get it. What's the difference between clinical skincare and skincare? Because what they call clinical skincare is just skincare on their websites. Like, it's just skincare. Mm -hmm. Also, Serums, can, face washes, moisturizers. I don't get it. Can somebody tell me why they chose that color of that font? And so we know bad. what it is because JJ and I use Canva all the time for our thumbnails. And any yeah. other content creators probably use Canva for thumbnails. Like I know the font that she's using and the she's using like the glow. You know what yes, I'm talking about, I love JJ? that. I use it all the time. I love it too. I use it on the thumbnail. But make this black so it stands out. Uh, or any other color than almost white. Like what are you doing? Like, even if you darken it, it'll be even more um, like the beige above it. You know what I mean? Yep. Or make it green like the aloe oh, yeah, plant here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever. Nobody Just can read it. That. I prefer dumb science. Thanks. Love that. I prefer dumb science. Crazy man. Back guarantee, which that to me stood out the most. I've never seen a 12 month money back guarantee um, with any skincare company. Yes. So to me, I can serve my customers with comfort saying, guess what? You know what, if you buy this regimen and if it's not for you, that's okay. We have a 12 month money back guarantee. How crazy good is that? All you of our products excited. are gluten-free, paraben-free, sulfate-free, cruelty-free. We are um, Weeping Bunny certified and made in the USA in our own lab in Las Vegas. Oh, if you God, do live no. in Las Vegas or if you're ever in the Las Vegas area, they definitely welcome anyone to come by with open arms, which is incredible. I will tell you. Should I go by and should I get those glasses that have the secret camera in them? Should I go like this with a secret camera? Yes. <laughs> Next time you come, we're doing that. Okay. We are doing it. <laughs> That's going to be fun. <laughs> First hand experience. I was geeking out at the lab, at, at what, how big the distribution center is, the systems they have. Uh, they say that their biggest competitor is Amazon because Amazon prime will get there within two days. So they make sure that your packages are there within at least three. They're, they're pushing for their average time is two days, six hours. Incredible. Right. Okay. Let's you move on to our skincare quiz. So this skincare quiz, I feel like has helped us tremendously as um, beauty advisors to get our businesses started. Cause sometimes we're like, Oh, you know, there's so many different regimens. It's hard to figure out which one to choose. Well, this skincare quiz is a one minute quiz that's going to give you and your customers um, the exact regimen you should follow, which is incredible. So this skincare quiz is there to assist you to help. Is a skincare quiz a dermatologist? Like, or is it just computer generated? Like it, it, who, who set it up? I bet you anything a distributor did. I mean, yeah, yeah, 
I mean, like, just, I, I know. Going to your dermatologist can cost more money. Um, but also, it's going to someone who knows what they're talking about. And all in all, the products will likely work better that your dermatologist recommends. And the MLM products are probably just as expensive. Yep. Go to the esthetician or derm guy. Or my der- or derm guy. My guy. Or derm my guy. Yeah, esthetician's mm-hmm. great too. Or actually watch some dermatologist videos. Exactly. Like BuzzFeed set it up. <laughs> so I love that. Um, and the problem is a lot of times with these skincare quizzes, I feel as though they ask very basic questions, right? It can only be very basic. Like, is your skin yeah. oily, dry, blah, 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 blah. And it's, and they're just like, oh, this is perfect yeah. for you then. If your skin's dry, use this hydration moisturizer. It's like, but that doesn't actually get to the root of the problem most times, you know, mm-hmm. go to your dermatologist. Why is your skincare? Why is your skin so dry? What are you dealing with? Like what, you know? All of that stuff. Is it something else that's making your skin dry? Like the uh, products you're already using. Stuff like that. So I don't know. I just feel like you should go to a dermatologist and not take a skincare quiz. Agreed. But I also am against MLM. So maybe I'm a little biased. Also that. Also leave veterans alone. If you're marketing to veterans, I'm going to stitch every one of your videos. 10 out of 10. <sighs> it's like Monet's hair quiz. <laughs> right? I want to look at some of their products and like the pricing. Like they have a, oh my God, they have a product. It's called Fake ID Glycolic Rejuvenating Serum. And it's $59.50 normally. It's on sale right now. Please. I also want to say, I don't think skincare quizzes are bad. I just don't think they're going to get down to the main source of the issue you know like if there is something that you're struggling with with your skin i wouldn't just take a skincare quiz and then go based off that i mean it could help someone who just wants to get different skincare um but it says let's target your most frustrating skin issues i i don't believe that that skincare quiz is going to do exactly that Um, oh my god you guys their concealer is 3250 3250? Guess how many shades they have? Four. Very close. They have six. And there are, okay. I'm so excited. My beautiful, beautiful humans of color. This is not the company for you. Of course. course. Oh, God. I hate this so much. If you're going to sell makeup, you better sell all the colors. I hate this. By the way, I'm going to shout out Linda. She's in the comments. I don't know whose channel she's watching on, but she has an affiliate code for one of the most inclusive lines for people of color and and just people in general as well. Like, it's just so inclusive. So, um, Linda, I don't know if you want to – I don't know if you want to put your link or whatnot, but if you're looking for makeup that's not an MLM – that's supporting one of uh, you know our channel members. There you have it. Because six shade ranges. Mm, I could do a whole video on that. Oh, like, that's here. infuriating to me. Here, I'm. Someone wanted to see it. I have it right here. On okay, my yeah, computer. show them because it's it's atrocious. It's bad. Okay, look, these three right here. Well, this one right here, the very you know the white the white one, right? Shade one. White these three. So we're at four. Five and six. There's no deep tones at that's, all. Yeah, that's that's all that there is. I wonder about their foundation. Yeah, please let's pull up their foundation because this irritates this irritates me. Oof. Okay, so let's see. Oh wait, and here's Linda's information. So the company oh. is called Minted Cosmetics, and her code is Live Pretty, which I love that code. Linda, I was just on that website the other day and I was looking at it, just seeing what they have. But check it out. Yeah. Wait, are there six shades? Is that is that their deep tone? These, are their, these are their shades. For whatever How this embarrassing. is. Uh, this is, it looks like foundation. Am I, am I wrong? It's a tint, age-defined tinted serum. Okay, let me see if I can That's find That's probably like a, a foundation. Like a CC cream or something. Yeah. How okay. embarrassing. Okay. Here's, here's their foundation. This is their colors. Oh, they have, it's only one. So they have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. And like these from like winning to magnetic are light shades. 
Yeah, those are not. This for... is not. This is absolutely. This is a no for me. Oh God, how embarrassing! I'm sorry. But, that shade you were on. Did they just say? Pets. Did they just say that's medium dark? What? Yeah, yeah zoom in, if you would. Here? On those. Yeah, there was one that said it was medium dark, and I was like, no. Uh, none of these say medium uh, dark. Linda, these, these are for light-skinned people. These are for white people. I'm just going to say it. How disgusting. Oh, my God. I hate it. Yeah. It's just, like, not enough. Like, look at, mm. you know, all of these shades from, like, here to here are light. Those are for white people. And these are the only dark shades. And then they probably, know. honestly, they probably talk about the darker shades, if you will as contour that's probably how they sell these probably oh god any hoot i hate it i just wanted to look at it but oh no. peanut butter and jolly that's cute is it ja is it jolly i'm like a medium tan and i think the second to last one might work for me that's yeah wild. it's just i mean if you're gonna be like a company that's solely about makeup needs to have the the stuff to back it up you know if you're Being gonna inclusive. like yeah absolutely like, at this point in in this world that we live in there's no reason that you can't be inclusive Agreed. it's ridiculous i bet money that darkest shade isn't even that dark in person yeah people probably yeah. use it for a contour to be quite honest with you like that's disgusting fenty has 50 colors yeah good yeah. i love that I remember when she came out with her line yeah. and when she, when she showed everybody what she was going to be doing with her Fenty line. Oh my God. Oh, yeah. by the way, this part silver lining, fewer opportunities for people of color to be scammed. Absolutely. And yeah. I, that part of it. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Um, pick the right skincare for you and for your customers. Let's talk about the environment. Um, Nobody can read that, so Mary. Something that another thing that I love about um, Beauty Society is, you know, all of our products are incredible and eco-friendly. Uh, we are, we were. I'm going to pause this because I don't even want to hear what she has to say. I just want to look at this and read this for, because I know nobody can read this. Yeah. So let me just read some of this real quick. Uh, let's see. By purchasing a Beauty Society refill, you're helping to replenish native trees and help alleviate extreme poverty through our Employ to Plant environmental partnership with Eden Reforestation Projects. Our goal is to plant hundreds of thousands of native trees in Madagascar, Haiti, and Nepal. Didn't she say that these products were made in the U.S.? But they're importing, I don't know, maybe this is just like their, how they're, how they're contributing or something. But anyways, these specific regions have been ravaged by illegal logging and clear cutting that have destroyed the natural ecosystem. Um, I feel like this is just kind of virtue sig signaling in a way. What do you think? Well, I mean, even look at the bottom, the wages that are earned in power men and women who've been exposed to human trafficking, extreme poverty, or lived as refugees. They are able to support their families and work on small plot farms. Their job is very specific. Reforest their nation for every... What do you mean? What are you talking about? Can you show me where this is true? Like, how, how does this have anything to do with that? I, I just don't get it. Well, and this is only for refills. This is not for... You know, every it, it would be, yeah, greenwashing. Thank you. Yes, that's what this feels like. It would be different if it was like for every dollar we we bring in, we donate X number to this organization. But this is yeah. like for every refill, a donation is made. That's that's exactly what it says here at the bottom. For every beauty society refill purchased, a donation is made, a donation that results in the planting of another tree. What about all the other products that are not? refills yeah i mean i think all mlms do something like this though you know to try to say that they're 
doing something for the people on the planet or some kind of like, like every MLM has this thing, like with Arbon, it had something to do with children and mental health. I don't know. Um, jump into Julie Joe's channel. Welcome. Thanks. Yeah, I love that. Um, go ahead and give it a, a, go ahead and lick the video if you could. <laughs> like it. Also, um, this, thank you so much. We appreciate y'all. YouTube things. Yeah, we really do. <laughs> That's so nice. Um, they all have something like this. There's, you know, if it's true, if what they're saying is true and it's going on, good for them. I really, yeah. really hope that, that that's exactly what's going on. Uh, I really, really hope it's doing good. Um, the issue is I don't, uh, th these kind of companies are so um, deceptive. I just, it's hard for me to believe that it is. <laughs> I, just, I just did their skin quiz. They're suggesting I purchase $191 worth of products. Of course they are. And how much of that $191 are they donating to this organization? Yeah, <laughs> I bet nothing. That's just my thought on it. You guys let me know what you think. Oh, man. All right. Let's keep going. Named the 15th, mo the 15th most eco-friendly company in the world, which is amazing. Like but also, we on plant what? a tree with every <laughs> Hold refill, on. refill purchase. So I'm, I'm gonna... you can get your skincare sets right. Um, they come in the regular bottle, but we all Hold on. I got to listen up? to her again. Yeah. Give me one second. I got to hear exactly okay. what she said. The company in the world, which is amazing incredible and eco-friendly. Uh, we are, we were named the 15th, mo the 15th most eco-friendly company in the world, which By is who? amazing. Business for home. <laughs> what a joke. The 15 most eco-friendly companies. Is that what you're looking at friend? Yes. Okay. Um, Ashley, 20, I saw your comment. How did, I how did 20 best eco-friendly companies, you know, but hold on. Hold on, let me go back. Uh, the 12 most eco-friendly companies on the planet. Okay, that doesn't help me because there's only 12. The world's 50 most sustainable companies. The, meet the 12 most eco-friendly, what? Environment. Environmentally friendly and sustainable companies, top 15. Yeah, let's do the top 15 because if they're, if they're, what did she say, 12 or did she say 15? What did she say? She said they're fi 15th. Okay, well then, yeah, they would probably be on there. If okay. that were true. Oh my God, this comment. <laughs> this comment right here. <laughs> what did it say? I'm the 36th best tenant in my apartment. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, so number one, Patagonia. Number two, seventh generation. Number three, a good company. Four, Belgium. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and just like, few, few, few. Go to number 15. 11th, aspiration of the mud jeans. What about MLM Rogue collaborative? Companies? Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Try it that way. Yeah, let me let me uh, stop screen sharing. So it was okay. Let me go back to what I said. Sorry, my dogs are having a good time. I love that. Uh, Don't top fifth, top most eco friendly MLM company. Okay, you, you lost your privilege. Is that Luna or Iris? Oh. Right, yeah, it's Luna. Iris just, Riley just said you lost your privilege. You lost your privileges. Go. Go. <laughs> you hear them? Yeah, they're wild. Okay, My favorite so part was watching them like watching him like shoo them out of the room. That was awesome. Yeah. Okay, so here's what I'm finding. I'll just read 10 top 10. 20 best eco-friendly companies you may know about in 2022. Um, top 10 MLM systems. Uh, top 100 MLM companies in the world as of 2022. Top 100 MLM and network marketing companies of 2022. Five environmentally friendly MLM programs for a green downline. What? Best MLM companies to join. Top MLM. There's literally no such thing as what she's saying. I would but love to know what, what her sources are, but you know we're not going to get that. She's no. just repeating probably what, you know, she heard with no sources. Yeah, th yeah I, I, there's nothing. And y'all are welcome to look too. If you find something, please let me know. So we plant a tree with every refill, refill purchase. So you can get your skincare sets right. 
Um, they come in the regular bottle, but we also sell refill sets. And every time you purchase one of those, we are planting a tree. Why not do it with the regular ones let's too? On. Okay. So let's talk about business, the business aspect. One thing, another thing that I, nobody can read this. Did you do it on purpose, Mary? Like nobody can read this. I named Luna after Luna Lovegood from Harry Potter. Aww. She had the same hair color pretty much. I can't even read this. No, that's me. Yeah. I know that for those of you that are watching this, sometimes graphics like this are really, really difficult. But for, for the most part, usually JJ and I can read some of this. I can't even read this because it's like it's been lightened so much. Yeah. Nobody, I, I can't read it. There's no way. Oh, this is called Beauty Society. I've loved about this company and what we have to offer is the road to success. I know, Avery jo. I'm going to tell you a lot of companies, you kind of jump in and you're like, where should I start? What should I do? Well, they map it all out for you. And I didn't even go into the university. Part. How, how well does it track when she's like, listen, they map it all out for you, but you can't read it. <laughs> that tracks, right? <laughs> <laughs> that, Our, that uh, beauty nice. society. We do have a beauty <laughs> society university that's that will help get you started get you knowledge everything that you need to know is pretty much in this university which is so helpful but then they also give you this road to success so they tell you hey schedule time with a person who referred you to beauty society the next thing and it goes through oh i'm sorry the first thing is actually book your zoom concierge call let me just tell you about this concierge call this concierge call is so important if you are a beauty advisor right now and you have not booked your concierge call i'm going to encourage you to go and do this but when you hear her say concierge call do you get the same vibe as when q scientist says you get a financial advisor do you, i get the same vibe like yeah i'm like oh i think of q scientist financial advisor bs you know what i mean yeah like, to me it makes me think like are you booking shows for me in vegas from my yeah. hotel room like what are you doing what are we talking about what is what what concierge for beauty society like is that someone's job or is that another person from your team or what this zoom is trash trash <laughs> book it right after this um basically this is your one-on-one -on -one time that you get with corporate to ask any and all oh, the questions God. they'll walk you through the back office how to get started need to knows any questions hey maybe you're allergic to some sort of um ingredients or maybe you're uh trying to figure out um how many distributors are there in this company if corporate is doing these one-on-one -on -one calls with people that join? That to me says yeah. there's not a lot of people in this company, which of course is why Mary is joining it so that she can bring her team because she probably had a bridge contract, just my opinion. I'm not stating that as a fact, but all of this is making far too much sense. Don't you think, JJ? Um, yeah. Mm. Yeah. There's a reason that she chooses smaller um, MLMs. It's because she doesn't have as much to go, like as many people to go up against. She can yeah. just get to the top really quickly with the team that she's already built in previous MLMs. Oh my God. Look at this. Great news. My normal non-problematic skin only needs $191 in beauty society products. Hey, can you guys, if you feel comfortable, go take this quiz and let's see how many people get the same recommendation for $191 <laughs> in products. That's Just awesome. Let us know in the comments if you're able to. And if not, that's okay too. That's awesome. I love it. Oh my God. These people. You know, what's the skincare quiz about or what ingredient, what I should use on my hair, how I should do this. You know, any type of questions that you have, you can go to this concierge, book your one-on-one -on -one call with them. They're always there to help you. I I will say this is the best tool I've ever seen in direct sales in my life because it's it's actually something that gives you a foot in corporate and gets you to see what what to do, how to do it, and they're there to assist you. It's not just about your upline; it's about you know getting started with the corporate as well. With um, the corporate, what? Then there's also our Facebook groups. Obviously, you can kind of go through this. This is our Facebook groups. Your 60% off promo code. So when you join today for $39 and you get your 
your welcome email, you're also going to get a 60% off coupon code that you can use one time within oh 30 God. days that you start. This code is amazing. Let me just tell you, you already get 25% off your- Somebody else got the same recommendation for $191. Huh. I got the blemish one for 162. Gotcha. <laughs> All right. Oh, this makes so much sense. Products mm -hmm. in the back office. Well, now you can go in that back office this one time and put input this 60% off code. Not only are you going to get the 25% off, but you're also going to get 60. So join as a distributor and then go in the back office and spend more money. Oh, but here's a coupon. So, uh, we have $162, $191. This is so fascinating to me. I'm in the UK. I don't know if I can do the quiz. Yeah. The recommendation really sure. was $385. I got two twelve for dry skin. <laughs> Holy fuck! Oh my god. Wild. Okay, this has nothing to do with what we're watching. However, I need to know who has been watching or who watched Love Is Blind season three. Totally has nothing to do with what we're doing. It's just it popped up, and I just need to talk about it. Look at all these: one hundred sixty-two, one hundred ninety-one, two twelve. Wow, this is interesting. Oh, wow. 385.50? Wow, they, they threw every product at you. Yeah. Oh, God. I'll watch the comments for the Love is Blind comments, but let's keep going. Percent off on top of that. So I bought my first order. It was like a $700 order because I was like, oh, just give me. Also, I need to know what you guys think of coal. Okay, thank you. Everything, right? Well, that $700 order was less about $300 because maybe even a little less because of how much percentage oh, off I got with the 25% and the 60. So it is incredible. And then this roadmap to success will tell you to start, start when to start sharing, uh, make your posts public, everything you need to know. This is usually in one long, long form. I kind of condensed it into, into this slide. So, um, but it is an incredible tool, incredible aspect. It's also on our glow page. Nancy, who is it? Or Nancy, we love Nancy on Love is Blind. Uh, Mary, who is this an incredible tool for? Oh, for you, because you probably get paid. This is this is giving Love Winks and their enhancement orders. This is giving Pure Romance and their enhancement orders. Call them out. Call them out. Ridiculous. Mm. As well. So if you don't know, our team name is Glow for Graciously Loving Others. It's Glow Society. Um, and let's go on to the next thing. She said their team name is Glow, Graciously Loving Others. Mary? <laughs> We know, you know that we know, you know that we know, you know, don't, you know that we know, Mary, you know that we know, and all of our friends here know as well. They know that you know that we know. <laughs> I'm just saying. Uh, same. Woo. All right. <laughs> That's all I have to say about that. Oh my God. Okay. So FYI, the concierge service is simply a 20 minute consultation with a team member. According to their site, sounds like you get assigned a rep, but don't talk to corporate. Oh, well, Mary, that doesn't sound. Oh, the lie detector determined that that was a lie, Mary. <laughs> <laughs> it's the giggle for me, JJ. <laughs> That's funny. Let's talk about comp plan. Who doesn't want to earn extra money for the you holidays? Read this. Okay, so we earn up to 45% commission. And this is just highlights of our comp plan. Um, we can go into this a little bit deeper on another call, but comp plan highlights. Let's talk about it. So uh, can we? You earn up to 45% commission on your personal and sales, 25% base mm -hmm. volume on all we customer should. orders. So if you've are you've basically sold hundred dollars, you're going to get 25% no matter what, but then you can earn up to 45%. Um, your volume and fixed bonuses um, are all fixed for beauty boxes, which is nice. So we earn when we have monthly beauty boxes that people, it's almost like an Ipsy box. It's super fun, super exciting. You can look at past beauty boxes that we have, um, but they're a 
very hot seller, probably our number one seller. And people sign up for them and love them. They're like a surprise each month. And there are a fixed volume on those beauty boxes. Um, you, your rank advancements, you do not need, you can rank advance without a team, um, <laughs> fast start incentive, which you'll see to your right. JJ, we definitely need to do a comp plan video. Cause I love when they say that you can rank advance without having to have a team, uh -huh. but what we typically find is sure you can, you can rank advance typically to the, the second, maybe even the third rank, but that fourth rank requires you to have a team. But of course they're very, they're very good at not, well, it's lying by omission. That's what that is. Yeah. So I definitely, you guys, what do you guys think? Should we do an, a comp plan video at a later date for this? What do y'all think? Right. And I will go over that. Uh, your fixed lifestyle bonuses for every month qualified, uh, personal volume thing. bonuses, weekly payout yeah. and withdrawal via hyper wallet, which is awesome. I love hyper wallet. It's a great tool. It just goes right to your bank account or you can even get a card with it. It's pretty, pretty amazing. Okay. Oh, let me go back road to success or fast start. So you can earn your first 300 in qualifying volume. You're going to get $50 beauty cash. That statement doesn't make any sense. Earn $300 in qualifying volume or she must mean sell. My question is always when we see stuff like this. Okay. So is this personal volume or is this through customers? Because if you're suggesting Mary, a $700 order, they're going to get $50 back on this. I bet you anything. That's what this is. That is nothing. <laughs> oh. And we see that they have to buy from 160 to almost $400 worth of products. I mean, because you know, they're going to buy products. If you're, if you are um, someone who's been recruited yeah. to work the business, you're going to buy a line of products. Cause you got to be a product of the product. We know yeah. that. And so you're telling me you got to, people have to buy a ton from you for you to earn not you're not even going to profit for a while very long. right um recruit three new advisors mm -hmm. that's part of their fast start so that doesn't even make any sense when she's saying well you can rank advance without having to recruit well why does your fast start program require you to recruit new three new advisors and you only get fifty dollars is that fifty dollars per person or is that hey you've got your three advisors now you get fifty also it's cool. beauty cash does that mean towards products they want to purchase? Yep, I bet you anything. I have product the product. biggest GD problem with this BS because Lime Life the same thing. Why don't you just pay them? Just pay, pay them. them. Pay them. Stop saying beauty cash. We you get to buy your products using this. Blah blah. blah. Put the money mm. in their pocket. Most mm. people aren't going to make money. Why can't you just pay them? Also, this part. Because I think I'm going to speak, I feel comfortable speaking for both of us. I think our favorite thing is going through comp plans and income disclosure statements because that is so confusing for so many people. And yeah. uh, I, that's our favorite. Like, I, I love it. I love yeah. when we do it together because she will, like, JJ will pick up on stuff that I miss and vice versa. And I just, I think it's awesome. So how interesting is that, that they were started in 2004 and there's no income disclosure statement? M makes sense. Mm, run you guys yeah no and joke if anybody happens to be watching this that is considering joining this company that should be a <laughs> giant red flag delight oh totally God. said they're paying reps with chuck e cheese tokens but that's exactly what it's like it's like oh here's 50 yeah. dollars so you can spend on our products yeah no Re you recruit three new people and you get 50 dollars to spend on products Ugh. put the money in their pockets. I want to know if that $50, if this is free product credit, which I'm sure it is. I want to know if that's going on their itemized 1099. By the way, I'm going to say this over and over again. It, I feel like it comes up in every video that I do. But if you're in an MLM and you think what I'm saying about free product <laughs> in contest, hey, Daisy B. I saw Tanya is in here too. Hey, Tanya. Oh, um, okay. So if you're in an MLM and you're like, wait, this can't be true. Like my free stuff, my free product, all those things that I win, contests, stuff like that. Ask your company for a, a, an itemized 1099 and just look at what's on it. Because all yeah. of that stuff is going to be on it because it's a giant tax write-off for them. And the, it, it motivates the reps 
to sell more or to buy more product where they make money and you lose it. Yep. Look it up. That's all I got. I swear. I literally hate, I have such a passion about that. Like they literally will do anything to not put money in their pocket. And it's so annoying. Current mood. Anyway. It's, we're going red. I love it. <laughs> Just beauty cash can be used on any products. Your first three recruits, you get $50 cash, sell three or beauty cash, then sell three infuse which is our hyaluronic acid drink. This is pretty drink? incredible, y'all. Everyone needs to be on this. I'm blown away by it, and I've only oh, been God. taking it for four days, and I'm I'm already seeing a huge difference in my skin, especially my lips. I can't believe how soft my lips are. Um, so you'll get the fifty dollars if you do all three. Mary, my three dollar chapstick does the same thing. <laughs> I mean, I'm a fan of the. I, this is this is nine dollars. This is from Maybelline. It's their lifter gloss. I'm a fan. This also has hyaluronic acid in this, it. Love it. This thing. I want to know what Mary gets when she has people finish this fast start. Because I guarantee you there's some sort of a leadership bonus for people finishing that. She probably gets $100 towards beauty cash. I bet she gets money. That would be wild if someone got paid money. Yeah. When they're working. Wouldn't it be wild? Wouldn't for Emma Lens, it's wild. Mm. I'm serious. I cannot stand this beauty cash thing. Like, are you for real? Like, just pay them. And listen, I don't even want you to work in MLMs. But if you're going to, you should get paid. This part right here. I'm surprised oh. you didn't join the Kendra Scott MLM, right? True that. <laughs> My name is Kathleen does that. <laughs> Look at the Love cat. It. Look at the cat in the picture. <laughs> How cute. <laughs> My cat Leo lays like that all the time. It's hilarious. Leo's so cute. Thanks. Three of those within your first 30 days, you get $300 cash bonus. This comment. $300. You can use that $300 on whatever oh, you want. But I'm bonus. just thinking, wow, that's a blessing because Christmas is coming and I know we could all use. I love how she flipped that. Let's just think about this in the terms of a profit and loss statement. We don't know how much it costs to join this company yet. We will. But think about this. She is, is coaching them to use those coupons. And the example that she gave was a $700 order. And I don't remember what she said the cost was because of the coupons and this and that. Okay. So they're out. Let's just say, let's just say $500. Let's just say that if we're following this map that Mary is putting together, right? Okay. So they're out, whatever it costs to join, plus this enhancement order of $500, uh, but then they have $150 in beauty cash, which they probably turn around and use to place more orders for products because they got to be a product of the product. But then they get a $300 cash bonus. So they're still in the hole. Oh, but if you do it in your first, you know, 60 days, you only get $150 back. So do you see what I'm saying? They're already operating in the red because this all sounds good. But when you really look at it like money in versus money out, what she is showing us and the way that she is telling us that she coaches her people to use those 60% off coupons or whatever, it's still money coming out. Regardless of, its, of, of if it's discounted or not, money in, money out. These people are all going to be in the red to start off with. Oh, just put it on the credit card. You don't need to tell your partner. Girl. Sounds mm -mm. like, um, sounds like um, Mary Kay. Mary Kay and their uh, partner. What is it? What's that plan? Their partner unknown. Or, I don't know if oh, called. God. The husband unawareness. Plan. There it is. I could not think of what that was called. Just anyway. open up a credit card and don't tell your spouse. Actually, they I'm say gonna, husband. I'm going to go to the bathroom, but I'm going to be listening on my phone. Let's go. The $300 cash. If you do all of those three within 60 days, you'll get $150 cash. And bonus. what do you get, Mary? So let's say you went a little longer then the 30 days, you still have an extra 30 days to get half that bonus, which is awesome. All right. So our today, our um, amazing, awesome sign up kit, which I love. I actually. Hey, Mary, if you put more adjectives with how you're describing signing up, it doesn't make it any better. <laughs> was there when they were creating the sign up kit. Nobody can read and this. So they were like, hey, what do you think we should put in this? And, you know, I I love our dry shampoo. And I knew that they 
you have to have the what saving in the grace is and the worth it because those are the two staple products. And then they added these fun little things as well. So it was pretty neat to see them get on the drawing bar board <laughs> yeah, yeah. and put this all together. Um, they do change signup kits every so often. This is this one and it's $39 and you'll, you'll get your worth it lip plumper, which There's five I'll tell here. you what, what that plumper works incredible. It is amazing. The dry shampoo. It's awesome. It's why is this giving like ipsy bag vibes? Is that what it's called? Ipsy, ipsy bag? Oh God. Yeah. If you see an MLM company, just like JJ said here, join us for $39, but pay $400 in product. <laughs> if you see a company and they're like, oh, it's a, it's a $400 value, but you get it for $39. That should tell you right then and there what their overhead is or what their markup, not overhead, excuse me. That should tell you right there how overpriced their products are. Wow. It's not aerosol. It is a powder. So don't worry. It's not one of those that you'll see that has been um, taken off the shelves or anything. Uh, you get your liquid luxury sample, your love life face sample, your light up compact mirror, which is awesome. That compact mirror is incredible. Well, this tracks. If you look at their site, it appears they only list active ingredients. They've got to hide behind those proprietary blends because I'd venture to say, again, I'm not stating this as a fact, but they're saying that it's made in the USA, but I bet they are importing from all over the place because the cost is lower. So this tracks. And then you get your saving face and it's all put in this gorgeous, amazing box. Okay. I'm going to stop sharing for a second and I'll kind of show you guys. Nobody read it anyways, Mary. The box. So all of our, all, everything that's packaged. The blurring. So it's going to get blurry, of course. Sorry. Everything is packaged in a beauty box with Beauty Society, um, whether that's a joining kit, whether that's just a customer order, everything is packaged so nicely and neatly and beautifully. And it's like getting a Christmas present every time it comes to your door. Oh so you definitely- Kirsty, hi. Uh, she said hey um, earlier, but I forgot to say that. Also this comment, they have a- uh, 12 days of beauty advent calendar for $99, $99 and literally don't say what could be in it. Just that it's a surprise and non-refundable if opened. Tell me it's a cash grab without telling me it's a cash grab. No joke. It's probably a bunch of sample size stuff that's valued at $39. <laughs> I love you. Hey, Riley, we love you. Hey, Riley, can you bring me a half sparkling sweetened, half unsweetened? Half on can you I have one it, too, Riley? It's good. Also, you know, what is that? Like the three it's like a king size three musketeer bar. Oh, I'll I eat just... like one today and then I'll like eat one tomorrow. I just, I, I just had some Halloween candy. Oh, all right. Let's keep going. Definitely look forward to all of your boxes, but this is our join up kit. Our joining kit. Mary, get rid of the blurred background unless it's a hot mess behind you, which oh. would make sense. Anyway, Nobody can it's, a, it. it's a joint kit, then you'd open it up and it's like a gift and surprises. And then you'll, her look closet. And you'll see like these ones are our customers. These ones are for just like if you just order whatever. And then our beauty boxes um, come in another different box. So oh, yes. you'll, our monthly beauty boxes come Karina. in with this pink. It's, it's beautiful. It's like almost... Um, Hey, Karina. Like a marbleized. It's something that's so special. And so everything that you're getting with Beauty Society definitely is thought of and prepared so well. And as you're getting started here, you're going to see our team is on fire, ready to take you guys to the next level. We are the fifth direct to corporate line. Um, and really, they they were like. Did she say fifth direct corporate line? How is that significant for anybody that is joining you, Mary? That means nothing to them. Wow. We weren't going to have any more direct to corporate lines. And I I was kind of, do I want to be direct to corporate? Do I not? And, you know, my team, they've, they've supported this decision. And so we're excited to be that fifth direct to corporate line to lock arms with you, to see you go. And Didn't that feel like an odd place to say our team supported this decision? Your team did but, not support that decision, Mary. That's not how that works. That, well, that seemed a little bit out of place. Also, uh, if she did get a bridge contract, I would love to know if she disclosed that to her team that are coming over. Yeah. I would love to know that. That would be great. Because I bet she didn't. If she if she did come in with a bridge contract, I bet she didn't disclose that. 
Ugh. Take your business to the next level, but ultimately to ha- build a community that's strong and enriched. Um, and so if you guys have any questions, I'd love to open this up. I'll, I'll open it up. You guys can unmute or ask questions in the comments and I will read them. If not, I really highly encourage you locking arms with us now because we are on an amazing adventure, but also it is the holiday season. Sales are up. We are having our daily sales right now. Tomorrow, we already know what that tomorrow is going to be. It's going to be this great hair bundle um, that's for sale. We had lippies today. Every day, there's something new that's fun and exciting here. So let's see if there's any questions. Can we make our own bundle sales? Um, yeah, I mean, you can make your own bundle sales for sure. You just have to, I guess you'd probably, I mean, you'd have to make your own graphic and then you could bundle them up and share what package what? you're doing with your That's customers. That's not what a bundle is. You want to, <laughs> if you wanted to purchase that pre-order, how would you do that? Um, Shelly, I know that you're, I'm going to ask or Renee, oh I know that both of you guys are on here. So let me see if I can make it so that people can unmute. I think I have it because just a second. Okay. So awkward. Now whoever wants to unmute can. All right. It's Renee. So Hi. if you want to do your own special bundle, you would have to have some inventory on hand. And then do those oh. or gather orders towards a party and then distribute that kind of like that. Because if you do a bundle, you're using out of your own commission. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. I was like, well, what? <laughs> so it'd be kind of a little tricky unless they have, I don't. She's saying it's okay. It is the same thing that I, I have a Love Wings video that's coming out. Mm-hmm. And when you do any kind of party and let's say like when I did love wings parties or pure romance parties, then you would do like two for bundles. Oh, you need to like like, product. You have to like buy the whole kit multiple times to get like multiple. No, no. Like, um, if I, if I were selling Reese's peanut butter cups and I was like, guys, normally this is, uh, a dollar each, but tonight, yeah, tonight you can get two for a dollar that dollar would come out of my my commission mm-hmm. my profit if you will or gross mm-hmm. it's not really profit because we know all the hidden expenses when you so, use candy i get it yeah yeah or we can do this or whatever but like anytime somebody is doing parties like this typically in these companies when you you are selling or you have a discount because you're trying to boost volume that's the only reason that you do those things is -hmm. because instead of selling one you're trying to sell two i can hear jessica in the comments going off like i can hear you know you do yeah and so let's inventory load to maybe sell a product right right that's what that's what we were advised to do in arbon too it was like for the christmas stuff because it quote unquote sells out it was like buy three big packages so it's like almost a thousand dollars one for you one for a party and one for people to try or something like that so think about this if you're doing a party and let's just say i'm being generous let's just say that there's 10 people there and you have one special where instead of um buying one product if you buy two it saves each of them let's say four dollars so if you have 10 people and they all buy that product Sure, you've doubled the volume that you're selling at the party for for that one product because people would have normally bought one, but now they're going to buy two. But out of those two, out of out of the bundle that you sold discounted at that party, you're losing forty dollars profit just for the volume. And JJ and and I both know, and you guys probably do too, if you've been in an MLM. In in my opinion, you chase volume. Yes. Not income. Yeah. Whether it's to rank up, whether it's whatever you chase, you chase volume. And that's why these companies do these things. That's why they teach those things. Yeah, exactly. Jessica, I knew you were going to be commenting and that 10% hostess credit. So like (laughs) your romance, um, love winks, companies where you're, where you're taught to do parties and you're supposed to give a hostess credit that all comes out of 
that representatives, that distributors profit. So if that person has a $500 party, that hostess is supposed to get 50 bucks. Then you add, did you do games? There should be prizes for games that cost money. Then if you did any kind of sales to boost volume, you lose money there too. Then if it's a company where you don't carry, uh, where you carry inventory like pure romance and you don't have something in stock, you have to pay to mail that package out or you have to set appointments to meet up with people to deliver their product. Do you see how this all adds up? These are not things that they normally discuss until you get in. They're like, oh, by the way, they have to get this. Oh, and then like pure romance, the hostess has to get a gift. That comes out of profit. That, that you, have to, you have to buy that. That's a requirement. At least it was when I was a part of it. So it all adds up and it's disgusting. She's with Beauty Society, Karina. And Jessica says, well, if you're doing volume, you can buy a six pack at a slightly bigger discount. Yep. Yep. Yeah. And it, this, they incentivize volume, not sales. Yeah. Oh, yeah. For sure. Yeah. yeah. And we were trained to have cute bags. Yes. To put the sales in, uh, plus the Pure Romance branded bags, order forms, catalogs, Um any kind of booking games, like there's so many hidden expenses that it's, that is not discussed. I have a video coming out next week. That's going to cover it, but this was brought up and I knew exactly where, th where they were going with it. So I wanted to like explain that a little bit because yikes. No, they may have a way that you can share the cart. I haven't seen that yet, but if they do have a share a cart feature that would again, it is. We are just getting launched. So I'll tell you this, you're learning right alongside us for this, for, I will say the technical stuff. We can all teach you how to run a business and sell it online and business, all of that. Mary. But when it comes to the tech side, we're all learning this together, which is kind of nice because we're really locking arms to say, Ooh, what did you figure out? It's not like there's the know-it-all person um, that's around. Around, there must so. not be a lot of distributors. Um, in company. Favorite products so far. I have a few. Like I'm really obsessed with this drink right now because I'm noticing such a huge difference, which is weird because I'll tell you this. I was really the biggest skeptic of this. Like I, I actually. They all say that. Be honest. Let's just be honest. No, you weren't. Right. No, you weren't. What is the price of that product? I wonder if it's one of the most expensive. And that's why she was like, I was a skeptic. I didn't want to spend the money, but you guys, this is so worth it. I'm noticing a difference. And she's going to give some vague explanation. You guys all know it's coming. Tea, right? Huh? It's the infused tea, right? Is that what that is? Yeah. Infuse. It's a hyaluronic acid inner skin treatment. Do you drink it or what do you do? That's what it sounds like. She said that you drink it. Yeah, you're so welcome. I do think that it's really, really important, especially because I think that, like I was talking about in my stories the other day, I shared a cold message from somebody that, well, somebody sent it to me. It's a cold message for somebody that's in Pampered Chef. You'd be surprised how many people tell us and other content creators, well, Pampered Chef isn't, Pampered Chef is not a, an MLM. Yes, they are. You know, uh, uh, NC's not an MLM. Yes, they are. They're MLM companies. Yeah. And especially if you're doing parties, all of these things add up. Yeah. Didn't she say she was skeptical about the last company she was with? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it is a beauty company. I'll keep going while you're looking. Okay. Okay. Had it for a couple weeks and I was like, eh, found it. Just gonna, uh, I, I didn't even. 162. Another person took a quiz. Alexis did. 162. Even though I put my skin isn't blemish prone or sensitive. Um, I found it. And one single bag, if you're not on the subscription, is $80. Oh, yes. oh dang. Is oh, sorry. How it's okay. Wow. But if you're on, but if you're doing a subscription every month, do you want to guess what it is? What was the what was the original price? 80. I feel like we're playing the prices right. Closest without going over. I'm going to say 72. No, it's 40. Oh, it's half? 
Yeah, if you have oh. a subscription. So if you buy it every month. Um, let me see. Yeah, so if you do subscription monthly, you only pay $40 a month. But that you have to have a subscription. Mm. Mm -mm. Felicity just did the skin quiz and got $385.50 package. Felicity, you better you better start saving money. Girl. You gotta, you gotta buy a big old package. Wow. Subscription is $40. So you're saving $40, but the subscription. Wait, wait, am I, I, I understanding think, that right? No, I think they meant they're talking about the price. Okay, yeah, I read that wrong. My apologies. It's fine. It's no worries. Oh my God. This is wild. I didn't try it until four days ago. I just put it to the side and was like, oh, okay. And so, and then I started taking it and I was like, oh, it tastes kind of, it's like a little, it says it's unflavored, but it does taste a little like, um, like a little citrusy, I would say. Oh my and God. I was like, oh, I kind of like the taste. That's tasty. And then the next day I woke up and my lips were not dry and I was like, that's really weird. And then every single day has gotten better, but I would In also say our foundation's really good. I love the foundation. She Any of the skincare course. products. Your your how many shades? Like nine or ten shades that don't include anybody with deeper skin tone. Of course, you love it, Mary. <laughs> are awesome. Like every skincare product I've tried. So, uh, Shelly, I see your hands raised. Mm -mm. Hello. So Hi. I just wanted to share my favorite thing is also the infuse. Um, today is my That's fifth sweet. day taking it. And I have a rash. I have, um, I have a, an autoimmune disease, Self PMR. And right before, um, it's inflammation in my joints. Mm -hmm. All of my. Oh my God. Shelly, don't do it. Shelly, Shelly, I'm going to stop you right here. Um, don't do it. Don't do it, Shelly. Do we it. know you're going to. Everyone's about to hear it. Don't do it. Oh my God. But. You know, let's just jump in. Let's, let's, here we go. We know it's coming. My big one. So my shoulders, my hips, oh. and I'll get a rash for wherever it's going to break out. Like, so my, my shoulders are where it's at right now. And so I'll get a rash and the rash will last like six weeks. I started taking it. So I'm in my third week and I've been, oh and it's been, it was so itchy and just driving me crazy. And I noticed yesterday I went like this and I'm, I'm like, wonder what it's not. And it's almost gone. So That's fifth crazy. day on it. And also my knees I've noticed <clears throat> with the inflammation is going down. And I'm thinking nope. to myself, if this, no, nope. <laughs> no, nope. no, nope. shut your mouth, Shelly. You That's beat me to it. <laughs> inflammation. Nope. We're not going there. Stop it. Stop it. Nope. It's no for me. Uh -uh. I'm That's changing it to I green mean. because they're so greedy with their health claims trying to sell a product that God. doesn't do anything. Inflammation <laughs> in your knees and this powder. Nope. Nope. I'm out. I'm you out. lost me. Nope. It's a no for me, dog. This is only five days. Yeah. And I'm only taking one scoop a day. Where am I going to be in three months? It's and what's it doing to the things that I'm not even in debt, aware that's of where you're gonna inside be. of me? Yeah. You know, if it's doing that just to that part of me, then what is it doing starting with my gut health? Because that's where it lands. I swear to God. <laughs> I swear to God. I cannot hate the words gut health more than I do now. The amount of times that I've heard it in videos, I gut health, gut health, gut health. I'm my gym right has a now, banner. Your gut is healthy unless your doctor says otherwise. Mm -hmm. If you feel like you're having some problems with your gut health, which, by the way, does its own thing on its own and needs nothing, go to your doctor and they will help you. Right. If you, if you take stuff that you don't need when your gut is fine, it is not going to be great for you that this it's either going to do nothing or cause some issues mm -hmm. like it could constipate you i mean you know obviously there's multiple different things but you don't need it if you don't need it Does this that make is sense? gross yeah this is and really is gross and all the things ugh. i ugh. hate it hmm. 
Let me change the clothes. I just, I hate how, because so many people have gut issues. I mean, so many people's guts are out of whack. And so it's really easy to, to uh, prey on those people, right? To try to get them to buy a product. Because a lot of times people will do almost anything to get the product, like to, to find something like to find a, a cure or to find something that will help them. Like I said earlier, like not in this video, but in a previous video, people who struggle with mental health, if mm -hmm. someone says something helped for them and like got them out of a rut, that person's going to try almost anything to get out of that rut. Mm -hmm. I mean, if you tell them that if you sprinkle salt on your eyeball and it cured me, that person might try it if they're having that big of a, of a episode or if they're really, really, really struggling. Yeah. So it's it's easier to prey on people who have gut issues and have had it for a long time, who have depression, who are tired and fatigued, it's it, who have chronic illness. I mean, there's so many things. And so, like, this is a great example of of a group of people they're preying on, right? Mm -hmm. and, uh, anyway. Do you guys? Jessica sent me this list from. It looks like it's from a team within Pure Romance. And it's a bunch of business supplies and resources. Do you guys want to hear all the things they suggest you order after you join and you're getting ready for your first party? Absolutely, I do. Okay. All right, here we go. It's quite a list, you guys. Uh, hmm. Name tags. The following vendor is approved by Pure Romance. So if like you wanted to have name tags made for you, you can only go through PR approved vendors. Please note, when you achieve the title of advanced consultant, you'll receive your own mm -hmm. business cards that you have to get through uh, Vistaprint, car decals that you order through Pure Romance, so they make money on that too, waterproof reorder labels. I actually forgot about this, but like the shave cream, I used to put waterproof labels on so that when somebody ran out... It was like, okay, they'll reorder because my information is on there. Whatever. Um, credit card processing. Uh, Square, ProPay. I haven't heard ProPay in forever. Um, sample containers. That's weird. QuickBooks. Uh, let's see. This person uses consultant front office to manage everything in the business from leads to bookkeeping. So it's probably like a CR, CRM, CRS, CRM. I don't know. I always get that confused system. Uh, display risers to go under your tablecloth so that instead of having just a tablecloth and products all in one level, you want it to be like elevated, if you will. Mm -hmm. Disposable lip gloss applicators e-newsletters and email marketing you can do it through pure romance for only 15 dollars a month uh, but it's free for your first 90 days this is where this company again is nickel and diming you'll see a lot of mlm companies that have their own apps and stuff and they're you typically have to pay for them even as a distributor uh, mailchimp look at that it's a free option for newsletters constant contact oh the lap boards <laughs> I used to take a three ring binder and cut the rings out and you'd have to get the ones with, yeah, like a spice rack. Exactly. Um, you'd have to get the ones with the pockets so that you could put an order form, a catalog and a pen all together. Jessica says it's called media center. So lap boards, uh, which are pretty expensive and you have to replace them because they disappear a lot. Personalized pens. <laughs> Uh, and they give a bunch of different websites and then free priority mail and shipping boxes. So there's, I think I counted like two resources that were free and that's MailChimp. And then you can get the priority mail boxes from USPS and have them delivered to your house for free. However, that is for back orders. And when you're sending things priority, it is extremely, extremely expensive and of course, you're paying by the size of the box. Like if you have like, they call them bedroom accessories. So if you have bedroom accessories that you have to mail, you have to put those in different boxes. And that money that you're paying to send back orders because you didn't have something in stock 
gift, if you're mailing them, that comes out of their profit. So if you have somebody that is just starting, they don't have a ton of stock, they're new to it, you know, their parties are super awkward, chances are they're probably not making a ton of money. And then you have all of these hidden expenses from the parties that are not discussed. So they're literally driving to the party. They're doing the party, which takes two to three hours, depending on the size. And if they're not selling anything, they're not making any money. And then if they do, you know, party say or yeah, party sales, um, the hostess credit, all of that stuff, they're leaving that party exhausted and they're in the hole. So Jessica, thank you for sending this. Some of it was definitely a blast from the past, if you will. But yeah, so that's how that works. Mm -hmm. Let's keep going. And so it's got to go from there and then distribute and then it gets absorbed. So I also have issues with my gut and my intestinal issue, you know, so I have oh that too. God. And I'm just extremely excited. And also as a, as an advisor, it's the easiest thing we're going to have to sell. Yeah. It is the easiest. It's, it's not expensive compared to everything else. What? And the fact that it works so fast and you have a 30 day money back guarantee on that. Um, Oh my God. I'll say, take a picture before you start drinking it. I wish I would. Yeah, I do because I didn't think that I had no I idea either. that I was going to do that. I had no idea. Yeah. Oh. I wish that I would. I really was skeptical because I'm a huge skeptic when it comes to wellness. And then when uh, I started, I was like, because I, I told you guys, I'm, I mean, if you don't know, I love another beauty, 191. All things beauty. And so I got in to the beauty industry for the makeup and the hair care and the skin care. And so, you know, wellness is fun. I always love a few wellness products, but I wasn't as excited about that to try it. So it was one of those things that I was like, ah, whatever, you know, and I, and I started to take it and I, and like my daughter has some bumps right here. Just, I don't know what they're from. I probably need to take her to a dermatologist, but I, I told her, I was like, you need yes. to start drinking this every day. I went, yeah, yeah, you should take her to the dermatologist. I like that. Um, that. Yeah. It's really that simple. Mm -hmm. Just, no. Like, don't use that instead of going to the dermatologist, please. You know, go ahead and follow through with what you just said you're going to do. Would love that. Yeah. I want to take pictures and see. So she started it today. Holly said, really? A huge skeptic? <laughs> <laughs> That's true. No, she's not. But I'll tell you, like... There, if you read the reviews online, it's review after review after review after review. And I thought these, at first I was like, these people have got to be lying. Are the reviews from distributors or are they from customers? Yeah, the, we all know. We do. Distributors. She's mm -hmm. like, these people have got to be lying. No, I think you're just putting on a show. Yeah. Like, I think you're just BSing us right now. Yeah. Right. You're trying to act like you didn't actually believe in the product. But then you talked about how renowned this company was at the beginning. So it doesn't check out. Is it actually as great as you said it was at the beginning or were you skeptical of it? Mm -hmm. Like, were, even yeah. though you were already in it, were you skeptical of this product? I think she's just putting on a show. I, I agree. This is I giving um, an honest review of X, Y, and Z product on YouTube. And then you go in the video description and you find out that they're selling that product. <laughs> And, and it's an MLM product. I've seen that too many times. Oh, God. Yeah. And now I'm waking up my mind. My lips. Like, it's weird because I have the most chapped lips and driest skin ever, especially right now when it starts to turn seasons. I just feel like everything's dry. And I have not, I feel like oh, there's some moisturized. And I know I have lip stuff yeah. good too. But <laughs> I will say it's like this whole, it's like your lips are silk. So uh, do we need a VIP yes, group for incentive giveaways? So I always encourage people to have a VIP group. I personally don't ever have one. And that's because I usually do a team one and we'll do it as like a team thing and make it so that we, and we are in the process of starting that. Um, Why are you going to encourage someone to do something that you don't do? Mm -hmm. That does not check. That does not check out. Huh. I have open the page to it. Shelly and I are going to work on this. Um, but I will say it is an, an incredible idea to have a VIP group. Um, but I also want to encourage you, if you do decide to do this, go live on your regular Facebook too, especially to get people 
interested in what you're seeing, what you're doing, and then you can kind of filter them to your VIP group. That way, Kirsty hit the nail on the head. You don't have a <laughs> VIP group because your focus is on recruiting. That's you don't right. have to sell the product to make money, ma'am. That's exactly right. Mm, nailed it. It's like, okay, eventually you can really focus on that VIP group. But right now, focus on the audience. I can't wait to try it. I, girl, I tell you what, you'll love it. Are there any other questions? I don't want this to run super long and take up all of your evening, but let me just tell you, go back to that beauty advisor that you know and join them today. I promise you, you will love this company. You'll love our team, I'm sure. Our team is amazing. <laughs> and you'll love this experience because I will say this experience has been the most refreshing experience I have been with in my career. Uh, from the organization, from Wait. the CEO. Wait, I wonder, did she say the same thing about the two previous companies that have gone under when she joined them? This has been the best experience, you guys. And then however many years later, this has been the best experience, you guys. And now here we are in beauty society. This has been the best experience, you guys. Yeah. <laughs> Dante said, I have a question. How dare you? <laughs> <laughs> okay. I love that. So from the way that they give back to the hearts behind it, to the ingredients of them product, the products and the products <laughs> to even just going on the corporate Facebook page and seeing how uplifting and encouraging. And, you know, you may see a live out of nowhere of, of Olivia showing her lip gloss or the new lip gloss today. And, you know, there's just things that on there that you're just like, wow, this is something that I have missed in my journey. And I hope that you get the chance and the opportunity to partner up with us and lock arms and see it oh. too. So um, definitely. Sila, she's probably been in beauty society for two weeks, maybe. Max. I was going to say weeks. Yeah. Definitely join. The shipping is super fast. Yes, it is super, fa super fast. I ordered with my 60% off on Saturday night and got her package today. That's Caitlin, she's feeling pretty much the same thing she's filled in Vic, like skincare, makeup, all that stuff. So mm. That's how quick our shipping is. Like seriously, our shipping, they try to do it. <laughs> they try to get it to people within two days and six hours. That's their goal time. Sometimes it's three days and they, and she's in Connecticut and they're in Vegas. So you can just imagine the ways, but they are definitely, up their corporate that's option. their biggest thing is to make sure things are packaged correctly and shipping goes out accordingly. So mm -hmm. I joined Bob. Scarlett requoted her and said, this bridge contract is the best thing that's ever happened. <laughs> <laughs> right. Happened. Yeah. Love it. Yay. Amy, love stay lock arms one <laughs> more time. <laughs> love it, love it, love it. All right, you guys, I have recorded this. So if great, I turned you off. <laughs> I can't. Okay. Great, I turned you off. <laughs> what y'all think? Oh, man. Aaron and I both put new videos out today. You put a new video out today, right? I did. Okay. Yeah. So go uh, watch next those. week is push week, everybody. Yes. I did five videos this week. I'm already doing push week. Dude, you're such a badass. I can't even deal with it. Thanks. I, 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 I didn't, so I didn't prepare this week like I should have. So some so of my videos are, I think they could have been better um, just because I did them like the same night that I posted them. Um, so this weekend I'm going to try to do better, but uh, like, you know, get them filmed earlier, be able to do better content in it. Um, but yeah, I did a I did a video on Kim Marshall today, which definitely well, I need to watch that one. Which uh, was interesting. Busy today. I actually didn't know much about her until a couple weeks ago, but apparently she's been like a part of the MLM grift, and people have known about her for mm. years. So that's kind of shocking to me that she's been so like. I mean, there's a huge Reddit about her, over six thousand yeah. people in it. That's crazy. Like. Mm. Jesse Lee's probably going to get jealous. <laughs> and um, <laughs> Cruel World Happy Mind, Madison, I think her name, did a video. Is her name Madison? I don't know. About, whatever. Did a video on her like two years ago. I was like, oh my gosh. Wow. Like, I had no idea. 
Um, I feel like things happen kind of in cycles with that because I know that there's people that I'll see on my radar and just like how you found uh, a video about Kim from two yeah. years ago. I feel like it kind of does this sometimes. Yeah. So, yeah, absolutely. Thank yeah. you, Christy. Thank y'all. Um, really yeah, go, go watch. Uh, we both have new videos today, so you can go watch those. And Mine is on Skylar. Shout out to Skylar. No way. You did a video on Skylar? Yeah. Yeah. All right, well, I gotta, you know. <laughs> it's an op it's the most chaotic opportunity. Did Isabella do that same video or was it a different one that she did? Uh I don't know. I don't I didn't watch Isabella. I think it's a different one. Okay. I don't so know. I guess they're doing more opportunity zooms because they didn't for a long time. Yeah, this was posted publicly by their social media person. So I'm sure okay. I'll be blocked after. But uh there was no information shared. I'll say that much. Nice. Yeah. Solid Thank you guys for being there. Yeah, thank y'all so much. Y'all are amazing. Mm -hmm. um, we appreciate all of you. And I uh, hope you enjoy this live and enjoy our videos. And you're, you're, you're awesome. Right. And make sure you subscribe, please. Oh, yes. That would oh. be that'd be great. Thank subscribe, you. Subscribe. Hit the lick button. Hit the lick button. Thank you for this compliment. I appreciate Aww. you so much. So sweet. And thank you for this. You guys are amazing. Happy Veterans Day to all the veterans out there. Yes. Also, thank you to my people on Twitch. I appreciate y'all watching. Yes. Y'all are the best. Um, also, I love that screen name, Peanut Butter and Jelly. That's, that's cute. so cute. I know we talked about it earlier. I just think it's really cute. Yes. Do the YouTube -y things. And um, Aaron? Don't join an MLM. That's right. Uh, we will see y'all next time. Bye, everybody. <laughs>